So the first thing you want to do is power on your machine and plug it in. For the sake of um, ease of use, we're just going to go with the USB, which is connected through a serial adapter in the machine. You can also use the serial port on the machine with a different adapter for whatever reason you're having driver problems. But uh, Debian and Ubuntu and Arch should work just fine with... Uh, the current serial adapter and it should show up in LS USB as Quinn Hang Electronics HL340 USB serial adapter or something ser similar it will be a USB to serial adapter go to your favorite vector converter in this case I recommend vectorizer.io and we're just going to choose this image uh, it's uh, a sort of stylized Tux the Penguin and we're going to go down to advanced options and we want to select max colors 2 we want a completely monochrome vector and okay there should only be one output color if your uh, source image has white a white background or something just de you just deselect that you only want what you want cut here so minimum area 5 pixels squared you want to add a blur of about 5% on larger images like this and then you vectorize and just check make sure it's nice and smooth and it is so download your SVG and then we're gonna open InkCut uh, it can be installed through pip3 there are tutorials on how to install InkCut in my case it keeps it in uh, local bin so that's why I've already changed into that directory and I'm just going to ready so I'm just going to close that and open this SVG okay it is a bit large we're just going to scale it down and you want to size your source material uh, luckily on this vinyl cutter there are uh, delineations on it so it makes sizing really easy and I, I would suggest you use the plotter attachment first uh, before you go and do the final cut to give an idea on how large you might want it. I'm going to go with roughly a little over 2 by 2 inches. Quite small, but works for the purposes of this tutorial. Load your material, set your home offsets, and then select the appropriate tool. In this case, a plotter attachment rather than the cutter, since we are plotting on paper. All right, when everything looks good to go, hit send to device. And this this case, it'll say it'll take eight seconds, which is actually quite fast. And go. If you get an error like that, it's just it's an easy fix. Just type sudo chmod 666 slash dev slash tty usb, then whatever number it says, it should match this string right here. And now when you try it, it should print just fine. Since we didn't like the size of the first one, we're going to try this again, but a little bit smaller. Now keep in mind on smaller objects, some details will be lost. Once you are ready, change out the plotter tool for this cutter tool and set your origins. Make sure you hit this button right here. And then you are ready to cut your actual sticker. So this is a problem that these cutters have. The tiny, tiny little bits can sometimes become detached. And you want to just cut the uh, material as close as you would like to the size of the sticker. 
And then, looking at your master, use a thumbtack to pull away. At the pieces you don't want in the sticker. And in that case, this is the problem I was talking about with smaller pieces getting pulled away. So you can use your thumbtack to have it retain. And then you've got an approximation of that, as I showed you before, a bit of the eye right here got detached. So, might want to rotate his, his wink just a little bit. Once you got everything weeded out, then you take your transfer tape and you lay it over your vinyl right here. Now, this form of vinyl right that I have right here, this adhesive vinyl, doesn't really have a high tack, so you might encounter some problems with getting it to come away from the transfer paper. Now we're just going to stick this to something uh, random and light colored here because again if I stuck it over here on something black like my laptop then the resulting image would be negative so okay so my camera wasn't recording but basically you peel it off of your release paper uh, and it will adhere to the transfer paper you stick your transfer paper down and you carefully coax it off as I showed the edge starts to come up uh, just push it back down and try try it again and again until it actually sticks. Uh, you usually don't have this problem with other vinyls, just the, the particular kind of vinyl that I have doesn't really have good adhesion. And real fine lines like this especially uh, don't really show up that well. Well guys, I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and definitely don't forget to hit that bell. Until next time, Thanks for watching.